Strafty, Strafty, and I just realized the antenna in my head is actually quite detailed. Anyway, uh, today we are playing another episode of Great Tech New Horizons Season 2. And last episode, we left in a rather sad uh, point, and they are feeling quite nice. Those two already filled, and they are feeling. And I just need uh, need to fill more TNT to the system. Anyway, and some of them is already ready. I crafted advanced circuit boards, and while I was planning to rush through the rocket, uh, someone from the Ham Corps Discord reminded me some me. Uh, I need a... I still need radon for the rocket itself, because I need the EV circuit assembler and it also requires radon. Luckily, I also reminded that I can get radon. Yeah, and I'm actually profiling some thorium. It also gives us Uranium, 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 yeah, uh, and I can centrifuge uranium, U uranium, uh, it's really hard to pronounce, in Turkey it's actually quite simple, uranium, uh, and platinum, uh, plutonium is also plutonium, it's actually quite the same, anyway, <laughs> Uh, uranium. Uh, I can centrifuge some uranium two uh, two three eight to get some two three five and uh, plutonium. But I don't need that actually. Yep. And if I let's put it here, and you will go here and here and here. You will turn into... You will get processed. Ah, you need HV and... Uh, yeah, I forgot you in... MV. Yeah! I need to fix that. Do I have any energy hatches with me? No. No, 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 no. Are you using uh, which energy hatch? I will just temporarily steal from you. Yeah, you are using this. So let me just steal for you, uh, you and temporarily shut you down. And also take this and the energy hatch. How to cable manage this? Okay, we wired some stuff and now it's HV. And perfect, thorium, and you are going to start. Yeah, yep, and so voila. By the way, I didn't need to steal the uh, hatches from uh, the other guy. Because I have some hatch here, hatches here. Anyway, uh, it's a learning po uh, process. Now, we are... We also upgraded this guy. That's good, that's good, that's good. And we should get some radium. Yes, that's the stuff we need. But, to process this, we also need an interesting guy. Uh, let's get you and put you, put you, put you, put you, and I think you let me just call uh, use this guy and uh, wait, what? Ah, 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 this. And if I can able to find, uh, by the way. But she is currently on my lap and she wants some uh, cuddling. Uh, so if you hear any purring, 
it's her. And lead. Lead, 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 lead. 16 lead. Come here, my friends. And we will make a relatively nice thing with this guy. And the TNTs are done. And let's place our TNTs to our mono generation. I actually like the system. I, I, I can make it much more compact. But it works. It currently works. Also, I have so, some uranium now. And thorium. And stone dust. And if I... If we look, yes, we have the lead. And all we need to do is place this guy and wait for eternity. Actually, not eternity, it's just 22 seconds, but it feels like an eternity. And yeah, we get some radium and the, yeah, they, 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 they do not stack. And I think I need to wear a hazmat suit. Oh yeah, yeah. Let's let's wear it. Uh, wear it. Wear wear. I don't know. Anyway, and let's put this to. I need to automate it. This, but it works for now. And those also got processed. And if we look at here, we should see Ledley linen box. Ah, it doesn't get scanned. Anyway, let's put you here. And uh, let's wear those and put those guys. I need to manually put, right? Yep. And uh, after they got also, uh, they also got processed, uh, we will get... We will get uh, okay. It's the, their decay uh, warning, and let's look at it. Decayables, okay, and also there are some uh, other decayables things. Nice. Okay, then we get fire for this. Uh, that nice. Uh, anyway, uh, let's look at this decayed radium. Uh, if we electrolyze it, we get radon. That's the stuff we need. And for that, we just need to wait an hour. And it's already late, so I will just process every single thorium I have and then just purify the thorium. And just uh, go to sleep. And later today, we will finally have a laser engraver in EV. And then we will get Terra Steel and continue with our Mars quest. Because, yeah, I want uh, Terra Steel before Mars. I want it. Anyway. And we are back. And, uh... We will see these parts eventually, but we did, we got a lot of radon. And also I crafted nanoprocessor mainframes that we need, going to need for our uh, thingamajiggy. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and before that, we also have some EV, uh, EV machines here. Circuit Assembler and Precision Laser Engraver are the new ones, and yeah, Ender Islands, you can stay here for now. Yeah, that's... Uh, it's actually... And why it's stuck? It, it's sometimes stuck. Got stuck. I don't know why. I'm too lazy to debug. I will do it later, but we're currently busy with... Actually, we're gonna replace this system uh, really soon. Yeah, I know I made this relatively new, but it will get replaced with the Applied Energy 6 equivalent of it. 
So yeah. Anyway, well, let's continue. Uh, we made our raid on. Uh, by the way, also I added a mercury processing thingy magic key here. Uh, this guy processes, uh, extracts mercury and inter uh, enters the into the system. And now we're gonna do something interesting. A nightmarish <laughs> recipe that uses tw 24 different items. And uh, by the way, I also improved the stability of the infusion altar and it's too crowded. I will probably redesign these in a in future. And those uh, floating flowers are actually a good uh, stabilizer. So it's currently 24. I think it's plenty of en plenty enough. And let's start. Wait. Ah, okay, six. Six, sorry. Yeah, it's gonna take some time. And we will just wait. Yeah, by the way, I did a bunch of rambling. I'm not sure if I'm going to delete it or speed it up, but holy hell, it was painful. It took more than three to four minutes and it's, it took forever, guys. It really took forever. Dream, please fix this recipe. <laughs> And uh, you can only sleep at night. Of course, of course. I, because it... Okay, and now it's night. Now, let's sleep. And place this fella here. And we're gonna need... Not you. This and this. And let's align it here. Yeah, that, that, that's a good alignment. And let's place these guys and then these guys. And then place this. And it should be okay now. And what we're gonna need is uh, it's here a spark and dominant augmentation. Voila! And now, uh, for this, I have to put my magnets away. But we're gonna need... Actually, do I have any mana diamonds? Yeah, I have. And mana steel... Tingy. And let's look at the book. Terra steel, okay. Uh, mana power, mana diamond, and mana steel. And let's also look at the recipe. It should also show... No, it doesn't show, right? And yeah, yeah, doesn't show. Anyway, let's make our first two mana steel and their power. Actually, get yeah, this much and some diamond. Yeah, float diamond should be okay, and some normal diamonds. Okay, take those and. Let's uh, remove our magnets. Uh, it's there's also another option for it, and we will actually use it in the near future. And let's do this and this. Okay. Now, if I do this, I will just drop one, 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 and yep, it starts working. And we got our first Terra Steel, guys. Woohoo! And 
for the first time, we got a trophy at the correct time. It's amazing. <laughs> it's something. And uh, let's actually do this. I don't know if it will work now. It needs to be one by one. One or... Ah, it needs to be one by one. Okay. Ah, even the Terra still doesn't uh, like it. Okay, that's good to know. And uh, having Terra Steel is actually uh, making Terra Steel actually kind of straight, uh, uses a lot of mana. But it's not that important. It's actually important, but uh, anyway. And we will make a bunch of mana Terra Steel. A bunch, bunch, bunch more of Terra ter Steel, but first I'm gonna make something important. That's something I love. Uh, mana Mirror. Mana Mirror, that's one of my favorite things in the Botania, the entire Botania. And it requires a Terra Steel plate, which is actually quite easy to make. Just this. Let me just scan you too. Yep, and uh, then I'm just gonna need. We have a living, uh, living boot thingy and an empty mana ta tablet. So mana tablet, come here, and living boot Twitch, and the rest should be super easy. And you will see. What is the mana mirror? Yep, mana mirror is ready. And what what we are going to do with this? And it starts replenishing our mana. I'm gonna link it here. And now, if I... Uh, where is my mana tablet? Okay, it's here. I will put it here and it will do that. And have still mana on me because the mana mirror mirrors the mana that doesn't make sense uh, and I don't have need the ring of aura now it's not needed anymore actually the terra steel equivalent can be still made and uh, by the way talking about terra steel equivalent I will just do that for the Ring of Magnetization. Yeah, and also let me scan this. No, it does. Ah, okay. Ring of Magnetization. Voila! And it should have a greater area now. Okay. That's good. That's really good. And... What we're going to do is made make bunch of bunch more terra steel. Actually, let's make it now, and uh, we can do two more right now. Yep, and the last one. And uh, with that, we are actually going to upgrade our armor, the entire set of armor to terra steel, and then. It will be the Terra Steel Armor. And Terra Steel Armor is much more stronger than the uh, Mana Steel equivalent. Mana Steel is still good. Still really good. And by the way, it also opens the por portal to Alfheim. I might actually do that too, because it's going to be super useful and it's actually easy. I. I take my word. Yeah, it's not that easy. And Pachi decides to jump on me again. Anyway, uh, we will probably do it later. Well, I'm actually quite some stuff to us. And the mana. Okay, yeah, you are empty. Nice. Okay. And after that, we actually replenished our mana thingy. 
And by the way, this mana mirror is actually a direct link to this. And as long as these chunks are loaded, which they are, I always have mana. I always have mana on me. So, yeah, uh, what I'm going to do is make at least 24 mana steel. That's something. And then to our way. By the way, a mana steel, ha a terra steel hammer is actually quite amazing. I will probably use uh, the new and uh, make the new tools out of terra steel. But terra steel is really bad for ones. And then we will probably uh, focus on our rocket fuel uh, generation. Yeah. I actually have to look at the recipes time to time because I don't need that much uh, Terra Steel. But I think I made enough. Now, what we're gonna do is piece by piece upgrade what? Upgrade our thingy magic. And the first part is Terra Steel Hel Helmet of Revealing. And voila! That's ready. And second is. And I need to get my chest plate for it. And Pachi decide to play with the toy. Of course, she just waits for me to record. And the enchantments are gone. And Pachi, please, 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 not now. Thank you. Thank you, honey. Thank you. And voila. And the third part is the legging. And with that, voila. And the last part is the Terra Steel Boots. Voila. And with that, we completed our Terra Steel set. I think it looks good, though. Anyway, uh, now we can reattach our uh, night vision lens and we are good to go. I just need to enchant this stuff, but for this enchantment, I can actually use a lot of thing, things. And also, since we have our warding thingy majiggy, and actually, I can just put you guys here. Yeah, uh, yeah, I can put you guys here. I can actually uh, fight with a wither a bit easier. Yep, uh, and also let's test our uh, thingy majiggy and the new armor uh, without any enchantment. And uh, let me just refill the wand and uh, let's fight a wither. I just realized I forgot to make the uh, window full screen. Anyway, uh, you know the time, uh, uh, which time I did the recording now. Okay, we made a simple uh, area here, and this entire thing is warded. So uh, it should be unbreakable for anything and i made an entrance like this to uh, let's say uh, protect the environment from the wither and with this this and this and the wither should okay and it's gonna explode yep And with that, I just... Okay! That was simple! <laughs> that was super simple, guys. <laughs> and I think I'm going to kill some more. Yep, and... Uh, let's... Uh, it probably doesn't have any d damage nearby. And uh, now we have small damage here. 
And that's a problem, that's a problem. Now the area is uh, small, so it's quite understandable to have some damage. But other than that, it's super easy. Barely an inconvenience. And we will just kill him time to time. And now with this, we finally finish this quest. Yeah. We can claim it now. And we actually can go to the Mars. Uh, but we first need to make our next tier of rockets. I don't want to recycle my uh, thingy. As I already told you, so we are gonna make a rocket from ground up and also an oxygen bubble uh, distributor. But this will be. Oh, by the way, I also enchanted my gear, and uh, all can I say is it's amazing. It's really amazing. And let another really really bad look like anyway i don't want to hold these guys because they are expensive anyway this is done this is done uh very very nicely and also our mana supply starts to replenish and i also add re-add these guys as a bo booster also one more thing, I will be away from home uh, about a week. I still have my laptop, but I cannot uh, record on that. It's not a good device for gaming. I can play GTA in H in low settings, uh, okay ish, uh, constant 60 FPS actually, but it's still not good for recording. So, I will probably finish the rocket here and uh, maybe uh, fuel automation, just cetane boosted diesel, maybe. I'm actu I actually want to make uh, this guy, which is r just done with coal tar and can I... Actually, I can get coal tar from coal. Yeah, that, 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 that works. But also this guy exists too. Yeah, I can actually get from a pyro oven too. And uh, with coal tar we can get actually a lot of things. And also naphtha and coal tar oil. You uh, give us something. Something. And with that, okay, it's I think another uh, rocket fuel thingy I guess but we actually need to make coal tar but for now we can actually use cetane boosted uh, diesel but uh, I really want to make this maybe next episode next episode yeah because we need to make this guy so yeah, I will decide that. I in the meantime I will uh, make the rocket itself and probably start making some resources for the Applied Energy Six uh, swap and much more compressed chests because we need to go to different, uh, actually three different planets, actually one planet and two moons, and uh. Yeah, that would be that for me. I will also probably craft the, that sword, the Terra sword, and maybe uh, Terra Shatter. That's actually the better version of the uh, hammer itself. Yeah, the Terra Shatter is actually quite OP, by the way, uh, as long as you feed it with mana. And uh, the basic rank doesn't do much, but uh, sub any subsequent uh, tier is 
super, super amazing. And yeah, that would be our current state. I will also probably uh, look at the upgrade paths of our tools and maybe upgrade them. And yeah, all I want is for you to give me some feedbacks. Maybe the video backlog will catch up at that point. And uh, actually engage with the channel because I want to grow this channel. I do. And it's not about the money thing or fame thing. I just want to grow this channel and have a community around it. Have a community around tinkering with, uh, in the games. And yada yada. Actually, similar thing about, uh, similar thing to my Turkish community. I just want to grow the global one. So, every interaction is welcomed. So, this is Scrafty Scrafty, and have an amazing day.